What's going on, y'all? It's JD Pakel today on CFB with JD. What is Texas Tech's new offense gonna look like under Zach Kitley? Welcome into CFB with JD, the people's channel for everything you know, everything you love about college football happens on this channel, happens nearly every single day. Would encourage you to subscribe. Armstrong Sims, Jet McKenzie, do the real heavy lifting behind the show and you, you drive the show. One way to help do that is at my Twitter page, JD Pakel. Without further ado, Texas Tech has a new offensive coordinator, nay, a new staff in town. Zach Kittley is going to be calling the plays. He is a disciple of Sonny Cumbie. He is an air raid phenomenon. He absolutely lit it up a season ago at Western Kentucky with this man right here, Bailey Zappi, who's going to give himself a chance to make some money in the NFL. What did they do so well offensively, and what are they going to do in Lubbock this coming fall? Well, I will show you. One thing they want to do right off the bat, create matchups. If they can get their guy one-on-one, -on -one, they're going to try and throw him the football. So right here, we got a short little in-breaking route right here. Short little in-breaking route right here. we got a pipe route. It's similar to a wheel. We're going to challenge here and get up here. He is the man we are creating in conflict. Now look at what's going on right here. There's no safety over the top right here. Safety's all the way over here. He has to get all the way to this side of the field to even try to make a play on this, on this guy. So listen, if he wins right here, we get points. Watch him get right. Boom, get off me. All this space. Again, look, he's chasing. He's trying to get there. He's doing his best, but you just can't defend a perfect pass and a perfect design by Kitley. Drop it in a bucket, kid. Touchdown. I absolutely love it. Get off me. Strike up the band. Now, they're going to take their shots. Like I mentioned, they're going to try and put you in a bind and take their shots. They're going to put pressure on a secondary all day long. Right here against Army, got a little stack formation. Look how wide they are. They're right to the numbers. This safety is the guy they're trying to put in conflict. So we're going to run a seam route of sorts, and we're going to run a go route on the backside. So if this safety wants to run with that, with that go route, seam route's cash money. If he wants to run with that seam, well, again, go route one-on-one. -on -one, what'd we say? They're going to give their guys chances to win. They're going to stretch you out, take some shots. Look at it. He's running with him. He's running with him. Do you see what I see? All this green grass, one-on-one. -on -one. NFL caliber kind of quarterback on Bailey Zappi, drop it in the bucket. Dial it up, Coach Kit. Love it. Win your matchups one-on-one. -on -one. You win one-on-one -on -one in this offense, you're going to score a whole lot of points. Against Michigan State, we'll wind it back so you can see with the score bug. We got a receiver down here below the Michigan State logo. He's not a big guy, so he's hiding behind the logo. Slot receiver right here. Safeties are over here. Again, they're going to stretch you out, take some shots. No safety back here. Safety all the way over here. I guarantee this receiver down low has a converted fade route, meaning there's no safety. The DB is playing pretty close, so we're good to just go. Takes a snap, looks deep. He doesn't look at his look at his demeanor. Catches the snap, kind of bobbles it to be fair. He knows where he's going with the football right away. Watch where his eyes go if you can. Boom, right there. He knows. He knows. Elbows going up. He's ready to deal. Put it on him, Zappy. We won down here, so we throw it to over here. Safety, you can't get there. Look at how much he has to defend. He's all the way down by the numbers. Just an easy little seam route. I should say an easy little fly route. You win one-on-one, -on -one, you get the football. That's how it goes in this offense. I don't, see, I don't know. I don't know why they don't cover you, man. I'm sorry. So, again, they want to stretch you out. You saw in that play. He's running pretty close to the tick marks on the sideline. Like he is running very wide, making them cover the entirety of the field. So what happens when you widen them out? Well, they start to commit. They start to flow with it. Right here, we got a little swing route. We got a little wheel route by our tight end. He's going to come up underneath that and have a, a skinny post, if you will. It's not quite a seam route, but it's kind of a skinny post. He's going to break it off up in here. Watch these DBs. Watch how they flow to try and stick with how wide this, this offense gets. He's coming down here. They're both coming over here like the Keystone Cops. We got our man running wide open, put a ball on him. Listen, they're trying to get there because of how wide this offense tries to stretch, and he's all by his lonesome. When you stretch a defense time and time and again, they start to get tired of it. This is a game that has a 53.3 yard wide field. That's a lot of grass to defend. Make them defend all of it, Kitley. And he says, okay, no problem. Right here, we get the perfect look. We're man across the board here. We're man right here. We're man right here. We're man down on the bottom as well. 
and he's going to come up and try and add in. He's going to try and green dog our running back right here. That's fine. Got an out route over here, have a deep go route here, have a deep go route here. Our third receiver has a little shallow slant. Well, what happens when he adds in and we're man across the board and they get lost in those deep routes? It means when he catches the football, uh-oh, a lot of space. You better make a tackle. If you don't, he's going to the distance. And, oh, this is the last thing he saw before his team had six points scored on him. Look at the, the oh, look at that. A little, a little instant replay by the vibe. Get open. Get off me. Look at the heat coming off the shoe. I mean, you could, you could essentially coast at this point. He and the ref are about to meet up in the end zone, see in the paint. Boom. That's what they're going to be seeing. A whole lot of in Lubbock. Widen out the defense. Take your shot. There is never going to be a game where they don't take five to six shots during the game. And I'm not talking about the crowd. I'm talking about on the field. All right? Listen, going to be a lot of fun to watch. A lot of points scored in Lubbock this season. Would encourage you to tune into those Texas Tech games. It's going to be a blast. Listen, this is your new home for college football. We don't talk about the offseason. This is the preseason because we're leading up to the games, all right? It's not that we're ever taking a break. It's always preseason around here, okay? This is CFB with JD. Subscribe to the channel. Do a video nearly every single day. Follow me on Twitter, at JD Paquel. We're going to keep the party rolling. We will see y'all next time.